everyone, this video is going to show you how to scan documents as PDFs using the Notes app on an iPad or iPhone. The first thing I'm going to do is open up my Notes app. And from here, I'm going to select the folder that I want. I'm just going to be in my iCloud Notes. And then I know it lands on my first note that is there, but I can just come right up here to the Compose a New Note. And then while I'm in there, I just select the camera and then choose scan documents. So I have a wonderful picture here that my niece drew. So I want to share this with people. So all I'm going to do is hover over the document or in this case, a picture and the app will actually just go ahead and automatically scan it for me. So now that it is scanned, you can see that it populates down at the bottom of my screen. And it's asking me, do I want to do a second scan, like a second document or a page two, or do I want to save it? So just to show you that you can scan multiple pages at one time, I'm just going to hover back over the same picture and it will automatically scan it for me again and populate down at the bottom. Now, as you can see over here on the right, there is an auto and a manual option. So if I don't want to wait for it to auto take the picture, I can manually do it by pressing the camera button. So now that I'm done, I'm going to select save and both of my scan documents populate here. And the next thing I want to do is share this with somebody. Normally, if I'm going to scan documents, I'm probably putting them in my Google Drive or emailing them to somebody. So what I do is I come up to the three dots and it does give me an option to scan again or I can share this note with somebody, or what I normally do is send a copy. So when I select send a copy, I can automatically, I can airdrop it to somebody if they need it, if they're in close proximity. Um, I can email it to anybody. I have my um, mail app or my Gmail app I can use. I can automatically pop it right into Google Drive, also OneDrive, and so on. The other option I have too is I can save it directly to my files. So however you want to save it, and then once you save it, you have it saved as a PDF anywhere that you need it. Super easy way to scan PDFs, especially if you don't have access to a scanner or a big copy machine that you can scan from. And you can do this from an iPad and your iPhone.